Hello, everybody. Today is Wednesday, November 4th, 2009. So it's my day to make a video. There's not much that I'm going to talk about, but there's a lot of solving that I'm going to be doing, and I'll get to that in one second. First, I would like to talk about CamCuber's new little online store thingy. You may remember my terrible online store, which has kind of dwindled out now because of school, uh, but it was terrible and crappy, and uh, I didn't really like it because of the way it was run and all that. But, CamCuber has a new shop. Uh, it actually is a real shop. It's not email-based. It is actually PayPal-based. <laughs> there's a shopping cart. There's everything. However, he only has two different items on there. White and black Tyan cubes. From what he said, they're really good. I've bought two black ones, and they will be getting here tomorrow. I'm really excited. I would have put them in this video, but they're not here. So, I can't really talk about it. There's a link to his shop over there, and a link to his video also over there about um, his video on him talking about it. So if you want to go check those out, go for it. As soon as he sells out of the Tyan cubes, he will be selling Type A 4 and 5, I think, and uh, probably some other cubes as well. Um, the one thing, though, that I'd like to mention is that he is located in the United States, obviously, and that there is free shipping anywhere inside the United States, which means that if you were planning on waiting until he has the Type A 4s and 5s, to make an order, you can make the Tyan cube order now, then he'll more quickly get the A5s, and then you can order again with no loss in shipping charge. I think it's a win-win situation, but hey. So yes, uh, I've, I was interested in it, and I already ordered something, so they're going to get here tomorrow. I am exciting. I am excited. So yeah, check it out. Link over there. Next, I'd like to talk about Cubesmith. You know that my color scheme that I enjoy is fluorescent colors, white, normal red, and light blue. However, I took a risk and ordered bright blue instead of light blue. I did this on purpose because I thought the bright blue would be, well, more bright. And, of course, it was, which is very nice, and it is actually, I like it more than the light blue. So, I have all my cubes with those on it, and I have two weird kind of stickers. First is their new kind of stickers, the mosaic stickers. Here is the pattern on the different sides. It's actually really cool in my opinion. I made this from a cube for you DIY, and it's actually a really nice cube. It's pretty easy to solve. The only thing, if I had any complaints about it, the only complaint would be is that instead of green they have pink. But oh well. Next, I have the shepherd cube stickers, which are ridiculous. I'm not going to be solving this cube. It took me 17 minutes to solve it the first time, and my mind was spinning in circles after that, and so I am not going to be solving it. This is merely going to be on my shelf as a wow, look what I have kind of thing, because it is not worth the bother to solve it. You know, I could probably get faster at it, but I really don't feel like it. I'd have to be nuts! Uh, yeah. So, uh, I would show you all my cubes, but I don't think it's really a big deal. I restickered my Joy Cube with the white side, of course, and uh, it's very nice. I'm very glad that I'm now using this as one of my main speed cubes. Only complaint I have about it is that it's white, not black. I'm not racist. Finally, the last thing I'd like to show you uh, is the 7x7. Replacing the stickers on the 7x7, um, while it is a monumental task that takes a good two to three hours, very, very, very nice results, considering you have very clean-looking cubes. And I put a white side, no logo, just because, and uh, it's really, really nice. Uh, I will be doing a solve of it for you a little later in this video. So that's really all I had planned. Oh, also... The Friedrich videos, the Intuitive F2L and the Tulik OLL videos, are on my channel right now. You can go check them out. I will not link to them because probably not everyone's interested, but hey, uh, they're on my channel if you want to go watch them. They are in-depth tutorials about 15 to 20 minutes long on just one video for everything in that little step. I've been teaching a few people at school, and uh, that's quite a bit of fun. It's really fun to figure out how best to teach people. Like, when you're right on the spot, not through a YouTube video where you can edit stuff and cut out stuff and add in stuff and stuff like that. I said stuff about, like, 12 times, but whatever. When teaching people on the spot, it is really um, different than through YouTube. Because you have to know what to say the first time or else you'll confuse them. 
Uh, so my two students, as I I could call them, I guess, um, have both learned to solve the two by two, and one of them is almost done learning the three by three. Uh, she can, they can both solve the two by two in less than a minute. She can solve it in about, the one of them can solve it in about thirty five seconds, and she's moving on to the three by three. The three by three that I used in my Friedrich F twelve intuitive two. The cube that I used in my intuitive F12 video is the one that she's borrowing from me to learn. So without further ado, I am going to do the challenge. This one. With the 2x2. Two two. Scramble 1, scramble 2. This is what I'm going to be solving to look like this one. Considering the length of this video, I probably will not solve the cubes. Like I said, I'll solve different ones at random times. So, I'm going to make this one look like this one, and we'll see how long it takes. Normal inspection time. Yeah. Snarf. That is not cool. Done. Yink, 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 and yink. So that is it, and my time was 25.31. So the only reason I like this challenge over, over the other ones is because it's actually, uh, everyone can participate in it, uh, which is nice, because and some of the other ones that we've been doing, like Speed 4x4, not people who just really own it 4x4 just make it, you know, different. What I mean by that is that other people don't really have a chance when the people own it 4x4. So yeah, those are the 2x2 solves, 25 seconds. I will talk to you guys next week.